back some of it. The footy now, they're dangerous. Jordan had a heap of the footy early. Beautifully played. Jordan's had a huge night. Got it down. It tells you Robot it didn't sense that the heat was coming from Jones. JJ, individual accolades aren't necessarily what you play for, but you must be proud to be this week's Rising Star nominee. Yeah, absolutely. I guess it's a, a great reward for some hard work uh, over the off-season. But um, yeah, like you said, uh, the team's going really good and I'm just really happy to be a part of that at the moment. 23 touches against the Swans. Are you feeling more comfortable every week you play at the top level? Yeah, absolutely. I guess the guys around me as well, like Track, Clary, Harmsy, um, Gorney, you know, they're all giving me some confidence. So um, I'm just happy playing my part for the team. And um, yeah, we're winning at the moment. So yeah, it's going very well. Defensively, your game's quite strong. You had 28 pressure acts and eight tackles. Is that something you really focus on? Yeah, I guess tackling, um, I say, is one of my strengths. So I just try to bring that, that each week. Um, and then, yeah, I can play some footy off the back of that, so. You have spent a lot of time with Clary, not only on the field, but off the field as well. What's he done to help your development? Uh, I guess just for the first couple of years, um, sort of just seeing what he does um, around the club, you know, in terms of his extras, um, how he reviews games and all that sort of stuff. So yeah, he's been a great role model for me and um, yeah, we've made a pretty good friendship out of it all. And yeah, he's a great mate of mine. Over the off season and in leading into this season, did you do any extra work? Did things change for you to help get you to this level? Uh, sort of just Burjo's program, um, you know, puts together a pretty solid program. I'd been on the list for, for two years and um, I felt like the end of last year um, I was getting pretty close to a game, um, but obviously with the finger injury happening, um, yeah, just made me come back more hungrier and um, I sat down with Choco and did some goals and uh, round one was definitely, definitely a main goal for me. Playing out on the MCG now, Saturday night footy and big, bigger crowds, you must enjoy that side of things. Oh, it's awesome, you know, seeing the MCC packed, um, it's pretty cool, you know, after the game, all the fans are sticking around and uh, yeah, it's just awesome seeing a smile on their face.